Welcome to Macroeconomic Modeling for Sustainable Development Planning, Modeling with System Dynamics. This course will be taught by Dr. Suleiman Diakiti. In this second module, you're going to learn about structure and behavior of dynamic systems. The objective of this module is to help you to understand the modes of behavior common in dynamic systems, which is an essential element in the modeling process. This module will also allow you to acquire knowledge on different types of growth. The basic behavior patterns in dynamic systems will also be identified as well as the feedback structures that generate them. These modes include growth created by positive feedback, the search for goals, created by negative feedback, and oscillations, which are created by negative feedback with delays. At the end of this module, you will have a mastery of the different types of retroactivity. You will also have a mastery of the different types of growth and have a good knowledge of the principle of modeling time series. You will also be able to identify the nature of growth of macroeconomic and social demographic variables. We begin with a quote from J.W. Forrester, the founder of System Dynamics. He says, like all systems, the complex system is an interlocking structure of feedback loops. This loop structure surrounds all decisions, public or private, conscious or unconscious. The processes of man and nature, of psychology and physics, of medicine and engineering, all fall within this structure. The behavior of a system arises from its structure. The structure consists of the feedback loops, stocks and flows, and non-linearities created by the interaction of the physical and institutional structure of the system with the decision-making processes of the agents acting within it. This section provides an overview of dynamics focusing on the relationship between structure and behavior. The basic modes of behavior in dynamic systems are identified along with the feedback structures generating them. These modes include growth created by positive feedback, goal seeking created by negative feedback, and oscillations including dumped oscillation, limit cycles, and chaos created by negative feedback with time delays. More complex modes such as S-shaped growth and overshoot and collapse arise from the non-linear interaction of these basic structures. Figure one provides an example of the common modes of behavior in the dynamic system. Figure two provides an example of exponential growth. Exponential growth arises from positive self-reinforcing feedback. The larger the quantity, the greater its net increase, further augmenting the quantity and leading to even faster growth. Figure three provides an example of goal-seeking structure and behavior. Positive feedback loops generate growth, amplify deviations and reinforce change. Negative loops seek balance, equilibrium, and stasis. Negative feedback loops act to bring the state of the system in line with a goal or desired state. They counteract any disturbances that move the state of the system away from the goal. Figure 4 provides another example of goal-seeking behavior. Here, Figure 5 provides an illustration of oscillation. Oscillation is the third fundamental mode of behavior observed in dynamic systems. Like goal-seeking behavior, oscillations are caused by negative feedback loops. The state of the system is compared to its own goal and corrective action is taken to eliminate any discrepancies. Oscillation, structure and behavior delays can exist in any of the causal links in a negative feedback loop. 
Oscillation can occur if there are delays in at least one of the links in a negative loop. Figure 6 provides an oscillation example from the business cycle in the United States. In the top panel, the deviation of the real GDP from the long-term exponential trend is shown. In the middle panel, we have capacity utilization in the U.S. manufacturing sector. And in the bottom panel, we have civilian unemployment. In conclusion, the feedback structure of a system generates its behavior. Most dynamics observed in the real world are examples of a small set of basic patterns or modes of behavior. Three of these modes are fundamental. Number one, exponential growth. Number two, goal seeking. Number three, oscillation. Each of these modes is generated by a particular underlying feedback structure. Exponential growth is generated by positive feedback processes. Goal seeking is generated by negative feedback and oscillation is generated by negative feedback with delays. More complex patterns of behavior, such as S-shaped growth, growth with overshoot and overshoot and collapse, result from the nonlinear interaction of these basic feedback structures.